take a look at an important aspect that examiners usually text the understanding of students, which is change in quantity demanded. Change in quantity demanded is when different quantities of a commodity is demanded at different prices. So the reason why we have change in quantity demanded is because of changes in price of the commodity only. So it can also be called movement along the same demand curve. Another name for change in quantity demanded is movement along the same demand curve. So it is caused by changes in price of the commodity only. Now, this curve is to explain change in quantity demanded. As you can see, at price 2, we have quantity 2. When price increased to price 3, the higher the price, the lower the quantity demanded. Quantity demanded fell to quantity 1. And when price reduced to quantity to price 1, quantity demanded increased to quantity 3 which is the law of demand. So the downward and upward movement on the same demand curve is called change in quantity demanded. Change in quantity demanded can be divided into two. Number one, we have expansion of demand. Some school of thought can also call it extension of demand. So expansion of demand is increase in quantity demanded and it is caused by a decrease in price of the commodity. So look at the diagram. You can see we add what price two, and the quantity is quantity one. So when price fell to price one, quantity increased to quantity three. So the increase in this quantity is caused by decrease in price. So it's said to be expansion of demand. The other one is contraction of demand. Contraction of demand is a decrease in quantity demanded, which is caused by increase in price of the commodity. Let's take a look at the diagram to explain contraction of demand. At price one, we had quantity three, all right? Price increased to price two. That means quantity will fall based on the law of demand to quantity one. So the increase in this price led to a decrease in quantity. So you can see the arrow, which shows that there is a decrease in quantity demanded, which is caused by increase in price of the commodity. Now, the summary of change in quantity demanded is that we could have extension or expansion of demand or contraction of demand. Please note that when we talk about change in quantity demanded, we can have either increase in quantity demanded, known as extension or expansion of demand, or we could have decrease in quantity demanded, which is also known as contraction of demand. And they are caused by either increase or decrease in price of the commodity only. 